home will likely be the largest investment any of us will ever make, but imagine that investment slowly being swallowed up by the earth. Over the past two and a half years, what began as a small crack in Julie Wallace's town home has become this. And if you look up here, you can see the brackets that are supposed to hold the ceiling to the wall. I can see the sky. Yeah, you can see the sky. Her home literally falling away from her neighbors. This house is on the verge of being condemned. I uh, came here about a year ago uh, and looked at it when the homeowners were still here. Um, they had some blankets that were stuffed into the wall. Um, they had, every time it rained, there was water coming in, uh, snow would come in. Essentially, this is the end unit of these townhomes and the very end unit is breaking off from all the others. I think we've got maybe six that are attached and if you can imagine like the Titanic, it's just snapping right at the end. see the separation there's perfect separation you can see all the nail the nails that are pulling apart uh, up in that bedroom these this is where we pulled all the pillows out of there and so we've got everything nice and clean so that when it goes back together it'll be like a puzzle it just fits back nice perfectly and so that's the goal here is we lift the south end once we lift up the south end everything will, will fit back together perfectly uh, just like when it was built measure the floor, we can measure the ceiling, and then we just know when we're getting right within range.
it up to level. Um, you can see when the house settles, so essentially it's like this and it settles, but it also moves laterally a bit. And so when we lifted it up, there is a small, um, maybe a half inch gap, maybe less in some areas. Um, but you can see a lot of this came back together really well. It closed up all the gaps. You can't see any daylight to the outside anymore. Um, all the joists and uh, you know trusses are back in place, um, but everything looks really good. So we can take a walk around the house, take a look at everything, and, and you'll see how everything could, came back together. lifted this probably a good 10 inches that you can see. I mean I can stick my whole arm and essentially crawl under the house if I needed to. I don't know why I would but I can see from here I can see daylight all the way under the house to the other side and it's completely off the ground. Where, yeah I would say at least maybe 10 inches or so where the house is lifted. And so the house isn't even sitting on the soil anymore. It's completely supported by these piers that has the house up in the air right now. It's actually sitting on 13 piers that are gonna make it much stronger than it ever was before.